Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Taurus November 27, 2022. Once past a suspicion or disagreement, it's easier to focus your attention on what truly matters today. You're incredibly astute at recognizing things of value. Today is suitable for opening up to someone special. It doesn't have to be a commitment or a statement if you're not ready to make one, but bonding can happen through expressing current feelings or stories about the past. An epiphany along romantic and creative lines related to private matters of the heart is likely to happen. It's an excellent time to be honest with yourself about how you feel. Good energy is with you for mending fences. You have a very special connection with Mars. This is because he is known to be exalted in your zodiac sign. Thus, whenever our red planet is weakened like he is now in a retrograde phase you also notice that things are a bit off kilter. Mars retrograde cycle significantly affect one's sex drive, ambition, and anger, and all of these themes can be played out in our relationships. This is why you may face exes or enemies from the past whom you had a strong and passionate love or hate relationship with. Use this time to reflect on them. If you'd like to heal or rekindle the flow, use the time now. Change your tune. You may notice a shift in your mental state as you consider your work when both Mercury and Venus in Sagittarius trine Chiron retrograde in Aries. How you view your conversations, workplace dynamics, and commitments may alter the outcome of your usual work life. If you have a more negative outlook, you may feel like more things are going wrong at work. However, if you shift your perspective to a more positive approach, you can begin healing aspects of your work that you do not like or want to change. While all the planetary activity is now on the income side of the financial fence and that will not only remain the case but is set to increase, there is reason for confidence when it comes to your financial situation and money matters. It is Venus, the planet of money who is helping to fuel your financial confidence, instincts and imagination today. While you're thinking about the future, it's important to tend to the present. Direct some of your attention to the development of good habits that help your vision. Consume spirulina, chlorella and other blue-green algae in healthy shakes once or twice a week. These and other sources of beta-carotene will increase the level of vitamin A in your bloodstream, which you need to support your insightful vision. Also, sports such as tennis that depend on hand-eye coordination are excellent forms of exercise. With this, it's a good day to slow down some and to spend a little time with your thoughts. There is considerable rejuvenation available with this essence, provided you take the time to seize the opportunity. A little daydreaming, meditation, or writing in your journal can all facilitate this. If you can take a day away from everything, consider doing so. If not, make the most of your evening. If sitting down to a good book or a hot bubble bath is your idea of relaxation, go for it. Give yourself a chance to recuperate. The moon might return to Capricorn every four weeks and this is always a valuable chance to check in even more so this time. This is not the moon's first visit since Pluto turned direct, but as it returns to your sign today it will be to find that the planet of change and revolution is picking up speed and there is a new sense of anticipation ahead of Venus and Mercury's return early next month. While your birthday month and new solar year are still four weeks ago, your sixth sense will be picking up on new doors set to open well before then. On the same day that Venus, the planet of love moves into her final two weeks in a nostalgic part of your chart and of the nostalgic trip down love's memory lane she is taking your heart on, the moon returns to Capricorn. This last visit before Venus returns will amplify Venus' friendly aspect to Chiron, the planet of healing who is still in retrograde motion, amplifying a sense of nostalgia. Our eyes in the sky. The moon enters Capricorn today, making us all want to relax and enjoy the earthy vibe. Today is all about appreciating your gifts and delighting in your courage. The swiftness and immediacy of your passion will come through even if you're afraid to take any steps forward toward a new decision. This might require you to be brave, but what you'll find is once you give yourself permission to follow through and trust your gut, you will never look back. 
a wonderful connection is made with someone else. This other person could be a co-worker or even a lover. Either way, this bond is helping you to reach new heights with regard to your career. Trust in this relationship. It will help your garden grow. Postpone any planned investments and purchases if you can. Unforeseen events could ruin your aspirations and projects. Keep hold of your money so that you can react flexibly to unexpected occurrences. Don't let yourself be taken in by bad advice you don't completely believe in. This is your time to shine. You have more clout in your career than you think you do. Other people respect you and believe in your ideas. Push your agenda through to the top of the pile. It will get noticed and you will achieve success. Think of this as the fool in tarot. It isn't really about knowing exactly where the journey will take you. It's more about trusting the feelings you have along the way. This is a time to let those instincts shine through. Make a promise to yourself that you are living this life for a purpose. You are here to follow a true and ambitious path, and right now nothing can stop you but you. Think of today as motivation for your future. You deserve the great things that lie ahead. After midnight, the Capricorn moon squares off with Neptune in Pisces, provoking confusion. Strange interactions leave us baffled. Optimism makes us vulnerable to those who would exploit us. Many of us will be asleep at this hour, and our dreams can be disquieting. Nightmare scenarios will have more to do with ill-fated choices than encountering shadowy villains. We can awake out of sorts, skeptical of our own intuition. You're able to complete outstanding tasks that require your undivided attention. The expert way you achieve results impresses others, inspiring you to tackle any new interesting ideas that turn up. Opportunities arise for you to make collaborative plans and a concerted effort to progress further, whilst utilizing the degree of proficiency expected of you. Your spirit feels caged. You feel like your work is suffocating you in some way. Make a conscious effort to unleash yourself. Talk to your employers honestly about what your needs are and how they can be better met. Work together as a team. Your current work structure is crumbling down. The fabric is tearing apart. Let it fall. You may the one support beam that is holding everything together. It is not your responsibility to bear that much weight. Let it fall and embrace something new. The cosmic weather is then quiet until before noon when the moon squares Jupiter in Pisces. We are still feeling energetically off, and therefore, more likely to seek out distraction to compensate for our disease. Extravagant behavior or caving to vices is cautioned against. Attempting to fix something to counteract weird vibes will only compound the issue. The moon then begins a short void of course following this aspect's perfection. 